Hello dear listeners, you are welcome to FX Free. Uh, this is another video on a VIX 75. As you know, uh, this is to show you a very perfect strategy to trade the VIX 75 alone. Uh, this particular strategy can be used to buy and sell at a perfect time, perfect sniper time so let's get going and see how it looks like and this is how uh, before we continue let me show you the settings we have as you can see the first setting is this is moving average actually and um, let's assume you don't have anything here so what you're going to do is go to the main chart here tap it when you tap it it will give you uh, different indicators so you go to scroll scroll down to moving average you tap it then you have this setting this uh, this setting actually has nothing to do other than to show you the trend whether it is a downtrend or uptrend that is it so just copy this or screenshot it so you configure it to move on so when you are done, you click on done. All right? This is what we just set now. Can you see that? That is it. So you scroll, scroll, scroll. You see, you can see the golden line up there. So it shows that this particular uh, instrument is down trend. And as it is, let's go straight to the setting. We have only two settings for this. Tap the F, then you go back to main again, the F in front of main chart. When you tap it, it gives you indicators. So you scroll down to stochastic oscillator. When you scroll to so stochastic oscillator, tap it and it gives you this. We have K period 60, D1, slowing 1, close close exponential, then 2 pixel for the main uh, pixel on the style so you choose any color you want signal two pixel as well choose any color then you go to levels we have only two there level 10 is buy level 90 is sell so we are done go to arrow back then click on done so you have the setting there as you can see here is the setting can you see that that's the setting, the stochastic, here it is. So, after that, you go to the second one, still under window one. You click the F in front of window one, all right? When you click it or you tap it, it gives you indicators then, scroll down to moving average, tap moving average. Then you have this setting, period 10 shift 0 method exponential close then style 3 pixel choose black or any color you want then tap done by the upper side of the right hand side you tap done so you have the moving average in it you can see the black color there this black color that is the moving average you set now then let's go to window 2, the second indicator. You go to main charts, you tap it. When you tap it, scroll down until you have RSI, Relative Strength Indicator, Index, sorry. So you, when you scroll down to RSI, you tap it, then you have this setting. Period 1, apply to close, 3 pixel, any color. Then you go to... Uh, the setting the levels we have 90 tp 550 tp1 we have another 5 15 5 then your style will be 4 pixel any color you want when you are done with that click arrow back then you click on done so you have the setup as you can see you have the tp1 you have the whole setup as you can see so that is that 
And let's move on to the last part. We're going to set a moving average for that as well. So you tap F again at the upper part of the screen. You tap this time around window two. When you tap it, you scroll down until you get to moving average again. You tap the moving average. You have this as well. Period one shift zero method exponential close three pixel and color black. When you are through with that, you tap done as well. We are all set for the indication. I mean indicator to trade uh, V75. Now this is how it works. When you discover that the trend, the trend, or let me say the moving average, the black black and the two indicators gets to the lower part, the oversold area of the two indicators. You need confirmation as you can see here. Look at this place. You will see that the moving average goes below level 15 and almost touching uh, level 5. Same thing we have here. Also, you can see the stochastic in the pink color that it touches the lower level of a pen. Can you see that? Then, before you go for a buy, you will allow the stochastic to be crossed by the black color. As you can see here, can you see that? It will be crossed by the black moving average color at that level 10. When that happens and you wait until the moving average faces upside, when you observe that, you go for a buy. As you can see here, that is where you enter for a buy. And look at the three green candles. Imagine this is V75. Imagine how much money you will have made by placing the order. Even if it's um, 0 0.001. This, as you can see, the green candles, you will have made around, let me say, $20, $30 plus from there. So that is how that works. Let's go for another opportunity. Only buy now. We are looking for buy now. Okay, see another one here. Look at this level here. You can see we have buy now by the left hand side. Can you see that? Buy now level. So this level and also this level. You will see that the black color and the stochastic crossed the pink color, which is a very good opportunity for us to enter and you look at from the main charts look at that place there so when you enter there see what you will get can you see meanwhile if you have a small account right small account from fifty dollar up fifty dollar small account so this is where your take profit will be this 50 level you can see tp1 if you have small accounts, not less than $50, so you always take your profit around TP1, which is a 50 level in the RSI. I hope you understand that. Good. So let's look for another opportunity. Buy now. Look at another one. You're very, very perfect. See that? See that? And here it is. So when you enter there, look at the big green candles, the big four candles. Look at, look at where it is, the four candles. So you take your profit for small account here, 50 level, TP1. And if you have big account, you allow it to run and you take your profit there. I hope you can see that. Very good. So that is buy. Now let's look for sell opportunity. We have it here as well. This is when you allow the MA and the pink color, the stochastic, to be crossed at the upper level of 90. Look at this place. Look at this place. 
You can see that in the stochastic, we have the pink color and the black crossed there. And we have the trend coming down. This is where it occurred. When you enter there, look at, just look at where you have it. Can you see that? So, TP1, always at level 50. If you have small account, you can see that area. That is where you quit it. When you have big account, you come to the level of 15 there, and you what? You close with a profit. That is an example. Let's look for another one. Always wait for good opportunity. This is very, very profitable. Very profitable. I bet you. This is a good buy here. Look at this level. A very good buy. Look at the candles up there. Look at until you get there. Very good one. And TP1 here for small accounts. That's that. Yeah, we have another good sale here. Sorry. Look at this place. This place. We have the cross there. And TP1 for small accounts. Look at from up here. Just look at. So you close around this place. Can you see that? So very, very, very profitable. That is how it goes. When you use it, I bet you, you can use it to grow small accounts. Look at here. Look at here. That is a very good buy. Just enter from here and you have it. The profit. So that is how it is. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Share the link with people and they are good.